actually was working with a few different names for the chorus, uh, and the, the, the top name originally was Joanna, which is actually quite close to my mum's name, and it felt a little weird. So we changed <laughs> it to Diana, which is actually weird now if you think about Joanna. It yeah. wouldn't really fit as well, yeah. do you know what I mean? Sings is good. Yeah, thank you, Nan. I know, we make them feel good, and, you know, they get the lyrics and it make, you know, have are like the lyrics that every girl wants to hear and it's, it's quite a well, very well written song and I would like to you know, thank my friend Louis Tomlinson here on behalf of myself and Zane for writing such a fantastic song. Hey guys, I have an extra microphone. Oh you guys wow, have. Wait, Holly Wire. Well, you shouldn't have it because you're with, you're next to me, you know how that oh, I works. want that one. Oh. Hey guys, how's it going? Hello, how Hello. are you? I'm well, I'm well. Midnight Memories obviously is out. I know, let's get close, guys. Get cuddly. Midnight Memories is out in less than a week. Um, yeah. With this album, you guys did a lot of writing on it. Does that make it more exciting, nerve-wracking for the release, would you say? Yeah, I think it's, uh, you know, it definitely is more uh, both of those things, yeah. actually. There is obviously the added pressure, uh, but it's it's great to have had that involvement and, and you know, that uh, vision on the sound is, is cool. Was there like an in-studio moment that stands out while making this album? First thing that comes to mind when I ask that? The uh, song Midnight Memories, the hook was originally I love KFC as opposed to Midnight Memories, so there you go. I love KFC, I forgot about that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah there you go. One DJ, obviously seven hours, that's a lot of pressure. Are you guys nervous for it? Yeah, obviously it's the first time that we've ever done any sort of TV presenting ever. It's quite raw, we're not going to really do anything off auto cue or anything, so we're just going to go with it and blag it and hope for the best. Is that why you wanted to hold the mic to get used to the... Hey, welcome to Hollywire. So you guys are obviously the biggest boy band in the world, but I wanna, I want you to get nerdy with me. So what is like your nerdiest obsession? Something that you like geek out over? There's a band in the UK called Busted. And I would say that I was quite nerdy over Busted and now they've gotten together with McFly and it's the best thing ever. We're big geeks over comic books. Yeah. Are you guys going to say the same thing? Nice. You guys are always around each other so much. Can you do impressions of each other at all? Sure, my name's Nile. <laughs> yeah, boys, good one. Um, I'm Lewis. I'm uh, rubbish. I play for uh, Doncaster Rovers. What up, bro? It's in. What's happening, bro? <laughs> yeah, no, we're not very good at impressions, actually. Oh, yeah. Obviously, you guys have had such a big year. What's been the biggest highlight for you, would you say? Ooh, it's been, it's been oh, fun. Yeah. Right. My highlights and my hair have been pretty good. Uh, <laughs> I think that just the, the tour in general, like we just we just came off a, a tour of 134 shows, so that was it was it was cool. It's a big achievement to do a tour like that, and we're really happy being at the VMAs and the Brits and stuff like that. Always makes you really happy and proud and stuff. So it's really cool. Hello, Liam. Thanks. We'll keep kicking butt, guys. Cool. Yeah. yeah. Hey, yeah. Liam. Hello. How's it going? Okay, How are you? Come to join. Harry's behind you. So, boys, how does it feel to be back at the US X, X Factor? Good. good. Yeah. Feels good to be back. Yeah, feels good. Always good to be on X Factor. So when Simon calls you up and says, "Will you come and perform on the US show?" Can you just not say no now? Can you not say no to him? No. Well, <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. Yeah, yeah. I say no, though. You wouldn't Why dare. Would you want to say no. It's a great show. Yeah. yeah. And he's always been very good to us. This is our second or third year on it now, so it's great. Love yeah, it. and this is kind of, in a, well, even though we're in a different country, this is you know where we came from. So you know you got to be true to your roots, as it were. Big up. There was complete pandemonium when you arrived at the airport, wasn't there? You got trampled, didn't you, Niall? We all kind of did. Niall. Yeah, man. I got in the wrong car. <laughs> we, yeah, we all kind of did. It was all a bit mad. Uh, they're very aggressive to paparazzi here. Any bruises now? Uh, no, I don't know. Did you no throw any jabs? Did you throw a few jabs? Had to try and throw, throw a few jabs, but I wasn't tr trying to be as aggressive as them people. They were, they were not very nice people. The aggressors, we'll call them. Yeah, yeah. Do you think the paps are worse over here than they are in the UK? Or do you think. Yeah, 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 you yeah, do, yeah, really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. They, they are, just don't yeah. care. But for no yeah. reason. You know, we're gonna give. We're coming into the airport. All you have to do is just go, snap, snap, snap. Cool, cool, cool. We're in LA. Nice. But instead, jab, jab, jab. Push, push, push. Not nice. You were annoyed because you didn't get to see your fans. Yes, exactly. You think there's less rules? I think there's less rules here, isn't there? Yeah, man. Against paparazzi. Yeah. I think that's probably why. So, what about the new album, Midnight yes. Memories? Are you excited? Very excited. Yeah. Um, it's out on Monday. Um, it will be available on iTunes in any half decent music store. Um, and yeah, we're very excited. We've written a lot more on this album, so um, you know, we're excited for the fans to hear it. Were you annoyed that it leaked? Did it got leaked? Was uh, that a bit annoying? It was a, it was a bit annoying, but you know, it was, it's going to come out sometime anyway, so you know, the music's there for the fans, so it's all good. If they hear it a week early, it's okay. We worked hard on it and we're excited for it to come out as well, so. It's amazing, and they usually buy it anyway. So they yeah, usually get it, online. so they can listen to it, and then when it comes out, they usually buy it anyway. So they're and Justin Bieber's been saying he loves Diana. 
It's been raving about Diana. Who's that? Who's that? Justin Bieber. Oh, nice. Yeah. Yeah, nice. That's nice. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. Thank you very much. Appreciation, Mr. Justin. Thanks, man. And now you've got to go back to stage and perform. So what are you performing next? Uh, we're doing uh, Midnight Twice. Memories. Yeah. You can tell me. <laughs> You're not sure? Oh, I'm just not sure. But yeah. You just get up there and we'll perform it. Midnight Memories. Yeah. Well, it's lovely to see you all again. Welcome back to LA. Thank you. I hope you don't get trampled anymore. We'll try our best. I'd lose. I'd be starving. I don't know who'd win. I think it's tough. I think I think Liam or Niall got first. Yeah, Sorry, I'd, be, I'd go straight away. Uh, <coughs> I think me and you would be chilling at the end. Yeah, I think maybe yeah we would be. Me and Zayn would be in it to the end.